find the z parameters but the circuit is in delta form but the circuit is in the delta form so what i will do first i will calculate the y parameters later i will use the relations to calculate the z parameters is that okay i it is for it is asked for 8 marks i instead of using relations a z parameters can be calculated, calculated by setting i1 equals to 0 and i2 equals to 0 using this condition even it can be solved but i feel this method is more convenient because just i will apply kcl at this node kcl at this node and I, they will be compared with the standard equations i will get the y parameters if i use the relations then definitely i will get the z parameters so that so that i will follow this method only apply kcl at node 1 i1 current incoming these two are outgoing so that minus i1 plus what is this value it is already given it is already given ix by 2 what is this current v1 minus v2 divided by 8 that is equals to 0 do simplify this i1 equals to ix by 2 v1 by 8 v2 by 8 call this as equation number 1 it cannot be compared because ix is unknown term here ix is one more variable that should be removed we will see it later apply kcl at apply kcl at node 2 so apply kcl at node 2 minus i2 plus what is current flowing through this v2 divided by 5 what is current flowing through this v2 minus v1 divided by 8 that is equals to 0 do simplify this i2 equals to v2 1 by 5 plus 1 by 8 minus v1 by 8 it can also be written as minus 1 by 8 minus 1 by 8 plus what is 1 by 5 plus 1 by 8 it is a 0 0.325 v2 what is 1 by 8 it is 0.125 it is a 0.125 So I will write here 0.125 V1. Alright. So call this as equation number 2. Equation 2 can be easily compared with a standard equation. What is that? Y21 V1 plus Y22 V2. So that therefore Y21 equals to minus 0.125. Y22 equals to 0 0.325. Alright. So here ix term should be removed what i will do from the inspection what is this ix is that current flowing through this 5 ohm resistance then ix can be written as ix equals to v2 by 5 substitute ix equals to v2 by 5 in equation number 1 we will get v2 by 5 plus v1 by 8 minus v2 by 8 what is I1 here? 1 by 8 is what? 0 0.125 V1. 1 by 5 minus 1 by 8. 1 by 5 minus 1 by 8. Is that 0. Point, is that 0 0.075 into V2? Call this as equation number uh, two, uh, 3 now. Compare this equation with the standard equation. What is that? I which one? Uh, which step should be repeated? Arun. Hi, yeah. It's simple, man. Is that the, uh, Ix is what here? Is that current flowing through this branch? 
here in the data it is given ix is nothing but current flowing through this branch how to calculate current flowing through this branch voltage divided by resistance what is voltage of this branch it is v2 v2 divided by 5 is the current flowing through this branch Arun is that okay okay good oh compare the standard with the standard equation y11 into v2 plus y12 sorry y11 into v1 plus y12 into v2 so that what we'll get here y11 equals to 0 0.125 y12 equals to 0 0.075 oh. all right so write it in matrix form y11 is 0.125 y12 is 0 0.075 y21 is 0 0.125 y22 is 0 0.325 what is delta of y then can you calculate z11 z22 z23 sorry z21 can you calculate z11 z12 z21 and z22 can you calculate by yourself can you calculate all these values by yourself only calculator work is remaining which which method do you feel better i think this method is better if delta or a y connection whether it is delta or y connection so whether it is y or z parameters first you should concentrate whether it is connected in delta fashion or in star fashion if it is a star fashion go for the kvl means go for the calculation of z parameters if it is a delta fashion go for the calculation of y parameters use the relations then can you calculate this by your own can you calculate this by your own it is asked for 10 marks and it is in delta form so that go for y parameters first apply kcl at this node apply kcl at this node finished one two three four branches are connected at node one one two three branches are connected at node two apply kcl at node this node and this node compare with standard equations you will get y parameters use the relations you will get the z parameters so solve it by your own and send me your answers in whatsapp so that if you have done any mistakes means they will be corrected see weightage of this problem is 10 marks it is simple thing apply kcl at this node apply kcl at this node two equations compare will get the y parameters then use the relations to calculate the z parameter it's simple one and it is important solve this problem and send me your answers in whatsapp same thing can it be done by yourself same problem it is same problem see why i am showing these two problems means the same problem the, the same problem is asked two times in the university examination so that treat this as a, a five star problem important it is as an examination point of view see which is of this is 10 marks see here these are the probable questions see here this is define z parameters and determine the y parameters in terms of z parameters in terms of y six marks all right see here there are the expression for z parameters in terms of y mark parameters it is asked for 10 marks today's derivation see here again z parameters of the network obtained from the experiment explain how y parameters are assigned okay uh, it will be discussed later okay okay sure means today's uh, uh 
today's derivation and uh, problems they are very very important as the examination